Hello and welcome back to another video tutorial on the new features of Video Studio X3. I think you're going to like this one because it involves getting free stuff. This free stuff I'm talking about is content that you can download into several areas of the Video Studio application, including Burn, Easy Edit, and Advanced Edit. It doesn't really matter where you access the free stuff download, your new content will be installed wherever it's needed. When you first launched Video Studio and looked around, you probably noticed some areas that were a little sparse in content. For instance, in Easy Edit, when I ask it to create a movie and select widescreen and high definition, I only have one template available to use. Also, if I go to print disk labels, I only have seven templates here to choose from. And also, when I'm in Advanced Edit, I really don't have that many titles either. You may have also noticed these little round white and orange icons with down facing arrows in them scattered throughout Video Studio. These buttons serve several purposes. Most often this button will say learn more or go to help. Click on it here and you access the appropriate help file. You also get learning tips and hints and a message board. Now if you purchased and registered your copy of Video Studio and this is the key part a Get More tab will appear three days later. This Get More tab will allow you to download new content for free. This content can include fonts, titles, templates, menus, disk labels, and a bonus pack. Again, you must have purchased and registered your copy of Video Studio X3 to get access to this. Now, have you purchased Video Studio but nothing happened after three days? Well, you probably haven't registered it then. This is where you need to go to do this. Click in the round icon like we just did, then click on the blue gears icon here, product information and preferences. You will see a command that says register. Select that. Mine doesn't appear because I've already registered. It only takes a few seconds to complete this process. Wait three days and your content will be available for download. All right, so where are these get buttons located? Well, obviously you can see there's one there, right? Also, if I go to the titles area, I have one there. You'll also see it scattered about in Burn and the Easy Edit interfaces as well, but this is what you're looking for. All right, let's download our free stuff, install it, and see what new content appears, shall we? Okay, now that I've gotten just about all my titles, I'll install that one next, and then I'm going to go to Templates. Notice all the different kinds of cool template packs we have now as well. And once I'm done with that, I go to the Registration tab, and I have a bonus pack of movie styles, labels, menus, and another bonus font. All right. All right, I'll be back. One thing we need to do after we install all of our free content is we will need to relaunch the program for everything to show up again. So let's do that. Now I'm back, I have relaunched Video Studio, and remember that place in Great Movie widescreen and high definition where I only had one template? I now have several, including several categories. So that's been added. Let's see where else I have new content. In disk labels, where I previously had seven, I now have eight. I also have a bunch of new backgrounds for my CD labels. And when I jump into Advanced Edit, Titles area, Lots more titles, finally. Love it. Also, if I double-click titles to edit and go to my font list, there should be dozens and dozens of new fonts in here, although I can't actually pinpoint which ones they are. My font list is definitely longer than it used to be. So those came free with the downloads as well. I hope you see the value of getting the free content and of registering your copy of Video Studio. Thanks again. We'll see you in the next video tutorial.